Hello and welcome to Wells Knight's Patreon server. Today I'm gonna do um, my first video here on the server. Um, it's been like uh, six months since the season started, so there's a little bit I can show you. And um, right now, as you can see, uh, clearly see, I'm standing on top of the nether. And uh, I'm doing this because this was the, the first build I was doing. Um, behind here is uh, what I've been working on for like six months, which is finished finally. And um, but yeah, it's a, it's a PvP island. And yeah, I created a Reaper and an Angel, which are holding these portals that's uh, that are also connected to to this main hub of the of the island and um this is all made by uh, by me um and i've had no help from uh, the server but if we try to go in here it's um it's really amazing i'll i'll try to explain it but keep in mind it's it's my first time recording so <clears throat> as you can see um up here in, up here in the minimap um it's pretty dark and uh, there's a reason for that so if you ever played uh, like sky wars or skyland islands there there's this feeling of this void and i was trying to go after that uh so i came up with the uh, with making this pvp island and this is it i'm currently inside the tree as you probably can see oh and there's a cat <clears throat> and um and yeah this is a uh, this was a lot of work <laughs> a lot of hours and um and hopefully when i get to record some more i will actually try to do stuff where i will include like how to do stuff and, and use the environment how to build like that's what i want to do here on the world tonight to, to teach you guys uh, a little thing or two with terraforming. I've been uh, been told by uh, my my other players on the server that I'm doing an amazing job on uh, on the server doing terraforming. So I wanted to help you uh, learn a thing or two. So yeah, as you can see, this is a PvP island, and uh, and the void that I was talking about is um yeah it's uh it's pretty black and uh yeah well i'm using up to find so i can actually like reach a little bit further um which was which when i planned this out i didn't have up to find on but it just makes my recording smoother so i could so that that just makes i can see this little thing but but yeah, look at this tree. It's really big. And um, yeah, I, I was I was like three weeks sick, and um, some of the server pranked me with a uh, with the tree covered in slime. So. That was pretty funny, and they made a little angel by uh, my character. If I tried, I have this holy actually. I have a holy. Hello, sorry. And um, it's it's pretty neat. They they got a lot of details on. It. But yeah, this is um this is actually all spawn proof. Um, almost down to like the last few blocks. And uh, it's it's been pretty in a pretty amazing job. Um, Working with this and doing all this by hand. It's all done in single player, and uh, I can try. You can see, I can only. Uh, I cannot. If you can hear, I'm, I'm pressing my, my spacebar. I cannot even fly. So, so this is all made by me going up the tree and making the tree and going down and changing one or two blocks out. So yeah, this is a. Uh, what I've been mainly up to, but yeah, this is this is the the crown jewel. You go in here and uh, 
yeah, it's it's pretty much starting starting the terraforming pro project process. And would you look at that? Yeah, I like um, <laughs> I like to do a little bit of terraforming. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna just gonna put the bow in here because if if we go into this room. As you can see, I got five. <laughs> I have uh, five end crystals, and just to make sure, I over spawn proofed everything with torches, just to be sure that uh, because end crystal have a little bit uh, higher blast, so it will actually blast every end crystal there's here, it will blow the entire room up. Um, but yeah, I uh, I I went around and. Um, Add a texture in the wall and just going off this simple stone brick and cobblestone with the but we're just doing a little bit of terraform but then again I'm I will hopefully doing some video where I, I'll show you the process and how I managed to to get detailed work in, in such small areas um, but talking about small yeah uh, um, this is my uh, my bone crystal <clears throat> which sits in, uh, in this kind of dead hole, which is uh, which has this this very. It was supposed to be a void, but the end, like the bedrock, is kind of making it look like a like a void. That the crystal is a uh, is actually like uh, taking the earth energies. For itself, um, and then uh, a lot of terraforming. <laughs> um, yeah, and uh, yeah, that, that, there's a little entrance, but it, it's pretty much just the same. Uh, I I kept this wall flat uh, because I was not sure if I, I was gonna use this area to to like dig further. Um, but yeah, it's actually a, a working muff farm. Inside of this, I have some. Sorry, uh, I have some pistons that I. Uh, oh, have I been playing? Yeah, I've been playing without my sack. Okay, that's a uh, that's a bug. So <laughs> the first episode will be without sound. I will get that fixed. And um, and yeah. Um, it looks a little bit better from the upside, but but I think I made it pretty good, and um, I made this kind of like the middle theme because when we turn around here, yeah, <clears throat> this is a uh, work in progress as you can see with the shoulders, but uh, but yeah, I actually have a forge that works. Um, you can see even it spawns stuff, but uh, I made this hell forge, and uh, it works. If I uh, dump another dragon here, you can see it disappear, and then it's it works with this lava and just flows through like uh, hello somebody, just flows through. Had getting this feeling, and it it kind of have have two people come come down and look more detail like I detailed this so you can actually get a new feeling like a depth feeling in here with this kind of bloody uh, stony lava feeling but but then again uh, this is a SMP server so I wouldn't fill it up with lava because um, people were, were dying <laughs> a lot <laughs> at my base apparently but yeah, you can see, it's not it's not the fastest. It's only like four furnaces going, but it works, and I work here in a lot, so <laughs> there's plenty of time for it to cook. And then I made this. Um, I'm I'm not sure how it goes in recording, but no, that's not gonna help. Kinda kinda like this 
this face for uh, kind of like a half a dragon kind of um, or or something just to to give it some some feeling of um, of a spawner and um, the, the spawner uh, works and uh, the stupid skeleton yeah yeah it, it's 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 not so practical it's uh, it, it's just for show <laughs> Uh, but it works. It uh, it has a mind gut getting it, um, which will which is transferring the bones up to my storage room. And yeah, this is um, this is what I have done so far. And uh, I have to cover up these lighting just so nothing is spawning, just like I did over there. Um, just hitting the lighting, as you can see. Um, yeah, so I'll be right back with the with the next area. And welcome back guys so this is the the last place I'm gonna show you um, if you notice there's this these different uh, uh, beams coming up well I'm using a journey map uh, because I am doing and I'm in charge of this giant terraforming project uh, and I'm here to um, to try to work with, with doing survival and teaching you guys how to to, to, to do some survival uh, terraforming in, in larger scale um, so it looks good and it's it feels good and um, and this is gonna be the main area we got a temporary portal right there that we uh, have a little storage as you can see um, but over here in my next episode I am gonna I'm gonna try to make the giant portal um, and uh, as you can see we, we just did, did these little um, little openings so we know knew where one side goes just just a, as a marker so we could plan it and I'm not sure if you can see it but there's it's saying something exit because we didn't we couldn't agree on what to do there but we got um, a desert themed city that's gonna be going that way which has uh, a cave entrance as well and over here we have the dwarven entrance it will be a giant cave system that you will be uh, entering and um, and where there will be this this gate here in the middle of of this of this uh, this hillside that we are gonna make uh, around here and uh, and yeah, so in next in the next episode, I will um, I'll be clearing some uh, some trees, um, planning a little bit of roads, and uh, and I can take a little bit more of aerial aerial view. Um, there we go. And uh, you can see you just see this this place. It's huge. It's huge. And um and yeah, um, we're gonna be terraforming all of this. Um. Everything will be uh, will be thinked about and looked about and and yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the I hope you enjoyed it, and uh, I'll see you next time in the the first official episode on the the World's Night Patreon server. So have a really good day and a wonderful night. Bye.